So acne affects millions of people each year around the world, right? And while there are many prescription creams available to help treat acne, they can be expensive or they can be really just harsh on your skin. Even the over-the-counter products can leave your skin feeling dry, red, irritated, and just leaving you feeling more, maybe more self-conscious than you were when you just had pimples, right? So in this video, we're actually gonna discuss a study that came out and discovered that this herb is actually more effective at treating acne than prescription creams and even gentler on skin. So if you're like me and you have sensitive skin, then you are going to enjoy this. I think you're gonna find this really insightful. Now, researchers from Leeds Metropolitan University tested the effects of thyme, marigold, and myrrh tinctures on bacteria that causes acne. All right, and I'm gonna leave a link to this study in the description below for you to check out. And they did this by actually infecting skin pores and forming spots, and those spots range from whiteheads all the way up through uh, pus-filled cysts, so real serious acne. And you might be wondering, what are tinctures, right? Um, they are concentrated extracts made from plants. So the plant material is actually steeped in alcohol for sometimes days or weeks, and this process will actually draw out the active compounds from the plant. Now, um, the group used uh, all these different herbs together to try to kill the bacteria, and they found that all of them actually did kill the bacteria within um, after about five minutes of exposure, which is really, um, really great news. But they did find that thyme was the most effective of all three. And um, they discovered that the thyme tincture had actually greater antibacterial effects than the standard concentrations of benzoyl peroxide which is the, you know, the active ingredient in most acne creams, right? So uh, herbal treatment for acne would be really good news, particularly for the people with, you know, sensitive skin like myself. I personally have sensitive skin and I grew up, had terrible acne, had terrible cystic acne um, that was super embarrassing and nothing would work. I never tried any herbal treatments, but I actually did go through the route of using Accutane for about a year. And this was, I was affected with this all the way up until college. And I think this was maybe my sophomore or junior year in college, I actually did take that Accutane for a year. My skin was dry, but it cleared it right up. It was amazing what it did and how it helped my confidence. So the problem with a lot of these creams, um, you know, both prescription and over-the-counter ones, is that they have just these side effects that are unwanted, right? Burning sensation, skin irritation, um, just side effects that make it very difficult, especially if you're in a colder climate. Um, it can be really, really irritating in the winter months. So herbal preparations are generally just less harsh on your skin due to their anti-inflammatory properties, um, and they can just have less side effects than the chemical treatments. So this is really great news. So let's go over a couple different other health benefits of thyme, right? Because this is a really powerful uh, herb that we can use in different aspects of our life that um, that when we know how to use it can be really beneficial. All right, so the number one health benefit of thyme is it's just packed with vitamins and minerals, right? Thyme is a good source of um, iron, it's a good source of calcium, magnesium, potassium, and even contains a good amount of vitamin C. Number two is it boosts your immune system, right? So there are actually a lot of antioxidants in time that can help to boost your immune system and help your body fight against infection, um, against some other kinds of illnesses. Um, on top of that, essential oil has the thyme essential oil is, um, like we said before in the study, has really uh, great antibacterial properties, antiviral properties um, that can help with other sicknesses. Number three is it helps to boost our digestion, right? So it can do this by stimulating the production of the di digestive juices and by promoting the movement of food throughout our digestive tract, right? On top of that, thyme essential oil has been shown to be effective against uh, stomach viruses and other gastrointestinal infections. 
And number four is it relieves and can relieve respiratory issues, right? So the essential oil of thyme um, has been shown to be effective against, you know, bronchitis, whooping cough. Um, on top of that, thyme tea can really help to soothe your sore throat and soothe coughs. All right, so I hope this video was helpful for you. I hope it was insightful. Um, if you did like it, you're gonna wanna check out these other videos. They're really, I think you're really gonna enjoy them as well. So check them out right here and we'll see you in the next one. Take care.